Hi, I'm Sarah and welcome to my studio. So I'm here on the outside of the studio. I've managed to get some um, pictures up in the window. You probably can't see it because of the reflection actually. Um, managed to get a frosted window covering um, with my email address, um, phone number and website. Um, some black and white pictures in the window on this side. And on this side we've got another window display that will be changed regularly. Just put a little bit of greenery outside just to make it a little bit nicer. So let's go and see, side and see what uh, I've managed to do. So this is the entrance hall as soon as you walk through the front door. Uh, I've managed to get my doors changed, it painted white, chandeliers up, um, some wall art on the wall. spinning around now so you can see it from the other side. Some more wall art there. And then going through to the props room. I've got all my blankets organised in their own cabinet which is fantastic access. Um, having it all organised when I've got a shoot so I can just run in here if I need a new blanket and or a prop. My backdrops still need somewhere, some sort of storage container for them all to stand in. Can't really see the canvas on the wall very well because the light's shining through the window onto it. And wandering through now to the um, client room. This is where they'll come to view the slideshow, their session, and also do their in-person ordering. I've yet to put a plasma on the wall, but I think I've decided now I'm going to have a ceiling mounted projector. And then into the toilet and I've got a changing table which makes things a lot easier for mum with all the nappies and things that they need provided. And then going on through to the shooting room. I've had to put the lights on because it's um, quite a dark room. Um, as it doesn't get any natural daylight whatsoever. Um, I've just bought myself some scissor boom arms for the walls to mount the lights so that I can um, free up the floor space. That will be a lot better once I've managed to get those up. Um, I've also got a rocky feeding chair for mum. And you might have seen during the video I've got quite a few little butterflies scattered around the place. Well, I've got butterflies in my logo um, and so I've scattered around the studio that older children can wander around and uh, go on a butterfly hunt. So this is the kitchen. Not really done much in here but um, put a fridge in and paint the walls white. Nice selection of teas there for uh, mums. The fruit teas go down really well. So that's the tour of my little studio. 
So I hope you've enjoyed the tour of my new studio. I'm really pleased with the way it's turned out. Um, it's been a hard slog with all the decorating, um, but we've managed to do it quickly with thanks to uh, three of my friends who've helped me, Alison, Mark and Rod, and without them I could never have got it up and running as quickly as I have done. I've managed to do about four or five shoots here already, um, and I look forward to many more in the future. I would love to see um, some of you if you want to pop by for a cup of coffee or a cup of tea, it would be great. And um, I'm just so glad that I could share this with you. So thank you for watching, I'll see you soon. Bye. If that's what it takes to make me smile I'm gonna walk a hundred miles I'm gonna run right up this hill Summer sky or winter chill I gotta take a break, I will But I'm gonna run right up this hill I wanna hold the whole wide world Right here in my open hands And maybe I'm just a little girl A little girl with great big Here in my open hands And maybe I'm just a little 